Today we're checking out weird photos that are gonna make your eyes twitch. Of course, if you guys enjoy the video, be sure to drop a like. If you're new around here, hit that subscribe button. Let's waste no more time and let's get into this because it's gonna get really crazy, especially at the end. Check this out. Starting off with this right here. Someone went out of their way to make this a real tile in their house. Why someone would ever do this, I have no idea, but literally this is insane. As you guys can see, they clearly messed up. Every line was like perfect, right? You had the black, you had the white, the green, the black, but then somebody went out of their way and did that. Why would you do that? Out of all the things that you could do, why would you go and mess this up so bad? And also, this is just really ugly tile to begin with, and this is just the beginning. As you guys can see, this is freaking disgusting. If I ever see my house looking like this, I'm getting a new house. No way, not for me. You know what else isn't for me? Desktops that look like this. There's actually people in the world that their desktops look like this. And you know what's the worst part about this? As a, this guy is a gamer. This guy is one of us, okay? Now, this is a really old picture, okay? This is like way back. This is Windows XP, okay? This is a way, 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 way long ago. It's so old that you can tell that they're using old versions and old games. There's like the Steam icons old, Unreal Tournament they're still playing. Like there's old things on this desktop that really just shouldn't even be on this desktop. Like I, I don't even know what this guy like was doing with his life, but there's some serious things he's got to go and fix on here. And I think that it doesn't even have the date. You can't even see when this was, but this is gross. If, if my desktop was ever this bad, I think I would cry. That is a very, very sad, sad desktop. You know what else is sad? Someone that went out of their way and did this in an elevator. Now they have the first, the first floor, the second floor, the third floor, the fourth floor. Yes, you heard that correctly. I guess they didn't know that it's first, like one ST at second for two ND, third, three RD, fourth is right. But the rest, they just put S. So one, two, three, fourth. <laughs> I don't know why they did that, but they, they definitely, they definitely messed up. You get a fortune cookie, right? You open the fortune cookie. You're excited. Whenever I get a fortune cookie at an Asian restaurant, I am pumped. I'm like, let's see what my fortune is, baby. I open this bad boy up. And as you guys can see, no job is so simple that it cannot be done wrong. Now, this is a great fortune for a fortune cookie. Because as you can see, this job was done wrong. Like literally, like they printed it wrong. On, they, they literally had one job. Their job was to print the paper correctly. Get the text on the paper. They're good to go. For whatever reason, somehow, some way, they messed up. Embarrassing? I think so. But it's just a fortune cookie. The next one can't be that bad, right? Wrong. The Daredevil series. If you guys didn't know, it's a six-part Marvel series. It's a seasonal thing, all right? They had six seasons. It was great. As you can see, the second season, they just decided to just change the box. All comp They just changed it. Why they did this, I have no idea. Like, it's not, it doesn't even make sense. Like, it doesn't even, like, flow well at all. But somehow, some way, they, they decided to do that. And like, it's the worst part because when you put it in your DVD or in your Blu-ray shelf, it looks like that. It looks like a mess, absolute mess. Speaking of messes, this is ridiculous. This electrician had one job, all right? He had to hang up the chandelier, all right? And for whatever reason, this guy decided to hang up the chandelier, not in the middle of the chandelier hole. like. There's a specific spot the chandelier was supposed to go in this roof. And they decided, you know what? We're just going to put it wherever we want. This sounds great. And that's exactly what they did here. They just hung it up in the wrong spot. Like it was all okay. And I have no idea why. It makes no sense to me. But maybe it makes sense to you guys. Because honestly, this stove triggers me. I have an electric stove. They work pretty well. But it's super confusing if you put your pot in the middle of the circle and the heat isn't even in the circle. How is this possible? I don't, I, huh? Why? Why this is even a thing I have no idea. But somewhere, someone thought this was a good idea. You know what else someone thought was a good idea? Messing up this staircase. Now you're probably looking at this like, Garrett, what is wrong with this staircase? If you look closely in the middle, 
there is one poll that is completely wrong. Like, they just installed the poll wrong. It's upside down. Now, at the bottom of every poll, there is that indent. And for some reason, whoever installed the stairs didn't realize that they installed one of the poles upside down. And that's triggering. If you, if, if you have OCD, that will trigger you so easily. It's actually insane. Speaking of OCD, this is something you would see in The Sims, right? You would not see this in real life. But unfortunately for you guys at home, this is something that's actually happening in real life. Now, here's where it gets really weird. Apparently, this is a church. Now, they have all these lights here because apparently the camera in the back left of the room, you guys can barely see it, does not get enough light so that it can properly record what's going on in the room. So they added all these lights. Now, I am no electrician. I am no expert in lights, but I do know that if you want more light, you don't install more lights. That just seems very very expensive you could just get one light you guys see how my room is very lit it's like i'm in heaven itself well i only have three lights just get more powerful lights i don't know why they just they decided to do all this nonsense but somehow some way they did it they, they 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 for sure did that now this road is a little broken now if you're wondering what these black things are on the floor this is what happens when the road cracks the road service will come out and they will just fill the cracks with this stuff now this is supposed to keep the road together from absolutely getting destroyed over time as you guys can see this road has taken quite a beating i'm not sure why they shouldn't put a whole new road down but i mean after a while you got to realize like maybe this isn't the best idea but you know what Maybe they think that's the best thing ever. Looking at the next picture, you guys can see, uh, this is how you install urinals. But this is actually real life, not The Sims. Somehow, some way, somewhere, someone thought this was a great idea to install the urinal on the wall. Now, this is what I'm thinking. If you guys don't know how plumbing works, I don't even think this urinal actually works, all right? Because... There's not going to be plumbing in that wall. Like, there won't be pipes inside that wall. So, in theory, this urinal goes nowhere. And that's gross. Like, that is just disgusting. So, not really sure what's going on here. Somebody needs to fire this plumber. They did a terrible job. Oh, I don't... Listen, this right here is a big thing that, for whatever reason, Hispanic parents do often, okay? Okay. Uh, my grandma has done this in the past. I don't understand it. They literally put tons of stuff in front of the TV. It's like you're there to watch TV and there's tons of stuff in front. There's something wrong with this picture. And it's literally the fact that you have a ton of stuff. It never made sense to me. Regardless, if you guys enjoyed today's video, be sure to drop a like. If you're new around here, hit that subscribe button. I'll see you guys tomorrow with a brand new video. I love you guys. Click here to watch the next one. I'll catch you guys later. Bye, dudes.